This page made at least $30,000 in May alone, without ever showing their face and by using content other people made. In this video I'll show you how to create TikToks using clips from streamers or YouTubers and make money through the Creator Rewards program. I'll show you the whole process from finding the clips, editing them and going viral. And I'll show you a secret tool that will make the whole process 10 times simpler and easier. So let's go! So this page obviously makes clips from Kai Sanat's stream. And in May alone it has over 30 million views and they are either watching the streams and as they watch they pick clips from it or they use some other methods which we're gonna discuss later in this video to find well performing and viral clips. And they're pretty easy to edit which I will also walk you through step by step in just a little bit. So pick your niche and let's move to the next step. Step number one, finding clips. The first way is the manual way like I said watching the stream or watching the video and picking the best parts. So let me show you how you can quickly download those clips and get started with editing. I will show you three ways. If you want to find viral and well performing clips from Twitch, you should go to the streamer you want to repurpose content from, go to the clips tab and find the most viewed clips from the last 7 days. Or if it's a popular streamer, you can select in the last 24 hours. And don't only pick the ones that have the most views, you should always pick the ones that will make the viewers engage the most. Like is there something funny or kinda sus about about the clip. It can easily make people comment on it and you introduce layers into your video. This is what makes a video go viral. So once you have a clip from Twitch, just copy the link, go to a Twitch clip downloader, paste the link and download the clip. The other way is if you're watching a whole VOD and there is a clip at the third hour of the VOD, you should use this extension which is available on Google Chrome and you will see it on the top left of the screen. Just click on the icon, select the exact time from beginning to end and you're good to go. And the last method is a very simple one which is screen recording and specifically I'm gonna introduce you to the secret tool we're gonna use which will do multiple of our tasks that are coming up and we're gonna use one tool for everything and it is Uniconverter and specifically we will use Uniconverter screen recorder. Very simple to use we just screen record the clip it's by far the simplest way to get a clip but the only drawback is that our quality of the video will probably drop slightly compared to when you download the clip. Step number two converting the clip. If the video is downloaded in a format like M4V, it might be easier for us to convert it in order to make the process simpler. So we'll use Uniconverter's converter and we can just convert the VOD or clip to mp4 and I'm telling you to use this tool specifically because the websites you'll find online will be way slower especially if the video you will download is longer and if you download the whole VOD you can use Uniconverter Smart Trimmer in order to extract exact clips from that VOD within a couple minutes. If you want to download Uniconverter the link will be in the description. Step number 3 putting everything together. Now that we have our clips we're gonna use a video editing software like CapCut for completely free and we're gonna edit the clip, add subtitles and all that jazz and what we'll try to do is make our video more personalized, more unique. This is one of the factors that will make us stand out from the rest of the competition with the selection of the viral clip we used earlier. So we are going to import our clip, we'll duplicate it, crop the face cam which will be a separate layer basically from the screen, we're gonna put it on top and we're gonna put the face cam on the bottom of the video and the screen will be on top and then we'll make all the necessary cuts we have to make. We'll try to keep it one minute long for the monetization of course and we'll also do some changes to the video, add some effects, maybe some transitions if they fit. Just customize it a bit, make it different because that will help us with the monetization since we are repurposing content. Then after all the cuts are complete we're gonna use the auto captions to create the captions for the video. This is one way we can make it stand out. We will customize the captions and make them as unique as possible but not too much because you will make it look weird if you try too hard and this way you will stand out from the competition which will bring more engagement, more followers and of course more views. So now we customize our subtitles, our captions, there are plenty of websites for fonts which will make the subtitles look different. Of course we should also add a title to the video and now we can add some music in the background. The best music tracks you can use is from Nintendo because they're copyright free. Just search on YouTube Nintendo Music, Stream Music and select a track that suits your video, lower the volume and you're good to go. And you just made a viral video. Since we're getting Black Ops 6, which one of these Black Ops games did you enjoy the most? I literally beat this game on a Wii. Am I a loser for that? I might not be a loser for that. I beat this game on a Wii. <laughs> 
Black Ops 2, P3. Black Ops 2 is the best Black Ops to ever walk Earth. Do you understand me? So as you can see, this final result could not be possible if we didn't use our secret tool, which is Uniconverter. And there are a ton of other tools that Uniconverter has that can help you create a viral video and it will make it much easier and simpler because it's everything in one place. You'll have to run around and find the best tool for each task. You have everything in Uniconverter. Again, the link will be in the description. You can check it out. That's pretty much it. Now that you've watched this video, make sure to watch this video next because YouTube believes that you're gonna love it. See you over there.